Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your boy, Iceman and Bob. I'm here to do a mic audio quality test between the Apple AirPod Pro second generation AirPods and the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro second generation earbuds. Here is the box here for the AirPods. Here is the box for the Galaxy Bud Pro 2s. For those of you that want to actually see the case here on the AirPod Pro 2s, here they go. And here's the case for the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro 2s. Now, though this mic audio comparison is more so directly between those two, I will include the first generation Apple AirPod Pros here. And I will also include the first generation Samsung Galaxy Bud Pros here as well. You will also have a mic audio quality test here with my Sony 1000 XM4 headphones. And then finally, you will also get audio quality from my Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 phone. So I'm not going to bore you all with all the technical specs. I will quickly post that for you all. You can check another review for that. This is strictly for the mic audio quality test and then my review at the end. So let's get right into it. currently listening to the mic audio quality on the Apple iPhone 13 Pro Max phone itself. This is obviously an indoor environment and this is what the mic audio will sound like if you were to talk on the phone itself. You're listening to the mic audio quality on the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 phone itself. This is obviously an indoor environment, and this is what the microphone quality will sound like if you had to use it in a quiet indoor environment. For the record, this is a test of what the mic quality sounds like on a professional condenser studio mic. I wanted to include this as a reference so that you all can hear what it sounds like speaking on a professional microphone versus the actual phone itself, as well as the AirPods or earbuds. We're listening to the mic audio quality on the Apple AirPod Pro second generation AirPods. This is what the mic audio quality would sound like in a quiet home environment such as this one, perhaps at the office or some other similar quiet environment. Once again, this is the mic audio quality on the Apple AirPod Pro 2 second generation AirPods. We are currently listening to the mic audio quality on the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro 2 earbuds. Obviously, this is an indoor environment. So this is what the mic audio quality would sound like if you're talking at home or say perhaps a quiet office environment or somewhere similar. We're listening to the mic audio quality on the Apple AirPod Pro first generation AirPods. This is an indoor test, so this is what your mic audio quality would sound like if you were to talk in a quiet environment at home, perhaps the office, or somewhere similar. Once again, this is the mic audio quality on the Apple AirPod Pro first generation AirPods. We are listening to the mic audio quality on the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro earbuds. This is an indoor environment test. So this is what your mic audio quality would sound like if you were to talk in a quiet environment at home, perhaps the office or somewhere similar. Once again, this is the mic audio quality on the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro earbuds. We're currently listening to the mic audio quality on the Sony 1000 XM4 headphones. This is an indoor environment test. 
So this is what your audio quality would sound like if you were to speak in a similar environment, such as your home, perhaps the office, or somewhere similar. Once again, this mic audio quality test is from the Sony 1000 XM4 headphones. I wanted to take this quick audio clip so that you all can actually hear what it sounds like in this outdoor environment so you can be familiar with how well the noise cancellation is working on each respective mic. So I'm going to pause talking real quick so that you all can just hear. This way you all have a better idea of what, again, the noise cancellation is actually doing or not doing. And this audio is coming from my iPhone 13 Pro Max phone itself. I'm sitting about two feet away from the phone. We are currently listening to the mic audio quality on the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 phone itself. I am outdoors, however, I'm in a controlled environment, at least to the best of my ability. There are a few noises in the background. I can hear wind. There are a couple of cars that are going by. You may hear something, you may not. But nonetheless, this is what the mic audio quality will sound like in somewhat of a controlled environment outdoors on the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 phone itself. We're currently listening to the mic audio quality on the Apple AirPod Pro 2 second generation AirPods. I am outdoors. However, I'm in more of a controlled environment. So I'm only speaking at a moderate level, nothing too loud, nothing too low. This is what the mic audio quality will sound like on the Apple AirPod Pro second generation AirPods. We are currently listening to the audio on the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro 2 earbuds. I am outdoors. However, I'm in more of a controlled environment. I am only speaking at a moderate level, nothing too loud, nothing too low. This is what the mic audio quality would sound like if you needed to speak in somewhat of a controlled outdoor environment on the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro 2 earbuds. We are currently listening to the audio on the Apple AirPod Pro first generation AirPods. I am outdoors, however, I'm in somewhat of a controlled environment. I'm only speaking at a moderate level. I'm not speaking too loud or speaking too low. Once again, this is what the mic audio quality will sound like if you need to use it in this type of environment on the Apple AirPod Pro first generation AirPods. We are currently listening to the mic audio quality on the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro first generation earbuds. I am outdoors, as you can clearly see, but I'm in more of a controlled environment. I'm only speaking at a moderate level, nothing too loud, nothing too low. Once again, this is what your mic would sound like, or your voice rather, would sound like if you had to use the first generation Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro earbuds in an outdoor environment that is somewhat controlled, at least to the best of your ability. We are currently listening to the mic audio quality on the Sony 1000 XM4 headphones. I am outdoors. However, I'm in more of a controlled environment. I do have a little bit of sound noise in the background. There's some wind blowing and perhaps another sound here or there. I'm only speaking at a moderate level. Nothing too loud, nothing too low. Once again, this is what the mic audio quality will sound like should you need to use the Sony 1000 XM4 headphones in somewhat of a controlled outdoor environment. You are currently listening to the mic audio on the iPhone 13 Pro Max phone itself. As you can see, I'm outdoors. I'm by a very busy street. There is a interstate that you should be able to see behind me tons of cars going by there's wind noise all types of outdoor sounds so this is what the mic quality sounds like on the iphone 13 pro max phone itself 
this is what the mic audio quality sounds like on the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 phone itself. As you can see, I am outdoors. There is an interstate behind me. There is a busy road behind me. Wind noise and all types of outdoor sounds. This is what the mic audio quality will sound like in this particular environment if you need to use it on the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 phone itself. You are currently listening to the mic audio quality on the Apple AirPod Pro 2 second generation AirPods. As you can see behind me, I am outdoors. I'm by a very busy road. There's an interstate behind me, wind noise, all types of sounds. This is what the mic quality, again, sounds like on the Apple AirPod Pro 2 second generation AirPods. You are currently listening to the mic audio quality on the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro 2 earbuds. As you can see behind me, I am outdoors. There is a busy interstate behind me, also a busy road behind me, lots of sounds, wind noise, etc. This is what the mic audio quality sounds like outdoors on the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro 2 earbuds. You are now listening to the mic audio quality on the first generation Apple AirPod Pro AirPods. As you can see, I am outdoors. I have an interstate behind me, a very busy road behind me, lots of wind noise, all types of sounds. This is what the mic audio quality would sound like in this situation on the first generation Apple AirPod Pro AirPods. This is what the mic audio quality sounds like on the first generation Samsung Galaxy Earbud Pro earbuds. As you can see, I am outdoors. I have an interstate behind me, a very busy road behind me, wind noise, and all types of sounds out here. This is what the mic audio quality sounds like in an outdoor environment such as this on the first generation Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro earbuds. This is what the mic audio quality sounds like in an outdoor environment on the Sony 1000 XM4 headphones. As you can see behind me, I'm outdoors. There is an interstate behind me, a busy road, wind noise, and all types of sounds out here. Once again, in this particular environment, this is what the Sony 1000 XM4 headphones sound like. You are currently listening to the mic audio quality on the iPhone 13 Pro Max phone itself. I do apologize for any shaking if you see any in the video quality department, as well as me wearing my sunglasses. Now, I know some people will say there's no apology needed for you wearing your sunglasses, but that goes out to those of you that want to see my eyes. Reason being, if you look at the reflection in my sunglasses, I am simulating very hardcore wind noise. And so the wind is so strong with this fan that I just can't bear to look at the camera and actually do this test. So that's why the sunglasses are on. Hopefully you have been able to hear me and hear my mic audio quality during this entire portion of this test for the iPhone 13 Pro Max phone itself. I apologize for any video shaking if it happens to come through on camera. I also have to wear some type of sunglasses because if you look in the reflection of my sunglasses, you can probably see a fan going. We are simulating a very windy environment. If you had to use the mics on the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 phone itself, hopefully you can hear me. I'm not yelling, but I am speaking with authority, with power. I'm not actually speaking casually, but a little stronger than that, but I'm not yelling either. So hopefully you can hear me. This is the mic audio quality in a windy environment on the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 phone itself. You are currently listening to the mic audio quality on the Apple AirPod Pro second generation AirPods. I do apologize if you see any shaking in the video quality, as well as for those of you that wanted to see my eyes, I have my sunglasses on. 
Reason being, if you look at the reflection, you can see that there is a big fan beneath me. The wind is blowing. You probably see some of my clothes, like my shirt shaking. And this was just too intense to bear without sunglasses over my eyes in terms of focusing my eyes on the camera. So that's why I have glasses on. And this should conclude this portion of an extreme wind test on the AirPod Pro 2 second generation AirPods. We are currently listening to the mic audio quality on the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro 2 earbuds. I do apologize for any shaking in the video quality if that's what comes through, as well as me having my sunglasses on for those of you that want to see my eyes. If you look at the reflection in my sunglasses, you should see a big fan. It's just too intense for me to stare at the camera and bear the wind with my eyes, so that's why I have my sunglasses on. Hopefully, nonetheless, you should still be able to hear my audio quality, and this is as extreme as it gets in terms of being able to hear me. Once again, this is the mic audio quality on the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro 2 earbuds. We are currently listening to the mic audio quality on the Apple AirPod Pro first generation AirPods. I do apologize if you see any shaking as far as the video quality goes, as well as me having my sunglasses on for those of you that want to see my eyes. I do have a big fan. If you look at the reflection of my glasses, the wind is just too intense to bear focusing on the camera without having some type of protective goggles on over your eyes. Hopefully you all can hear me. Once again, this is the mic audio quality in an extreme wind test on the Apple AirPod Pro first generation AirPods. We're listening to the mic audio quality on the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro first generation earbuds. I do apologize if you see any shaping in the video quality, as well as for those of you that want to see my eyes, me having my sunglasses on. Reason being, if you look at the reflection in my sunglasses, you will see a big fan on. It's just too intense to bear the wind without some type of protection over my eyes. So hence the sunglasses and also hence why you may see some video shaking in terms of the quality. OK, hopefully you can hear me. This is simulating an extreme wind test on the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro first generation earbuds. We are currently listening to the mic audio quality on the Sony 1000 XM4 headphones. I do apologize if you happen to see any shaking in terms of the video quality, as well as my sunglasses being on for those of you that want to see my eyes. If you look in the reflection of my sunglasses, you will see a big fan on. That's why I have it on. The wind is just too intense to bear without some type of covering over the eyes. And that is also the reason why there may be some shaking in the video quality. Hopefully you all can hear me. Once again, this is an extreme wind test in terms of the mic quality on the Sony 1000 XM4 headphones. I'm pretty sure after all of that testing, many of you want to know what my final thoughts are regarding this test. I will say if you have any of these AirPods or earbuds, you cannot go wrong. The mic quality is excellent with all of them. Yes, sure, maybe one or the other is better, but if you have any of these, you are doing it. This is the best of the best in terms of Apple and Samsung. I know they do have other players out there that aren't featured in this particular video. What's my opinion in terms of the best mic audio quality? I'm going to have to give that edge to the Apple AirPod Pro second generation. It's very close and sometimes in some circumstances, I actually did like the audio better on the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro 2 earbuds. So it's extremely close. And I am actually capturing all of this footage on an iPhone. So perhaps 
that could cause some bias in terms of the audio quality that I could achieve. And I do have a Samsung phone as I showed you all. I just did not do the test with my earbuds on the actual Samsung phone. I wanted to keep them all on the same platform. So perhaps if I use my Samsung phone, I might have gotten slightly better audio quality. But nonetheless, just as this testing goes, I would give first place to the AirPod Pro 2s. Second place would go to the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro 2 earbuds. And then third place, I would actually almost tie it. But if I had to choose a third place, I would give it to the first generation Apple AirPod Pros. And then number four would be the Samsung Galaxy Pro first generation earbuds. Now, as far as the headphones go and the phones go, I just threw those in the mix. I don't really feel that it's kosher or proper for me to rank them since I'm not doing a direct comparison between headphones. Um, I did do a comparison between the mic audio on the phones. I will say the iPhone has better mic audio quality in terms of just picking up your voice. Now, in terms of what my opinion is, after doing testing with overall sound, no if, ands, or buts. If you want sound, I don't care if it's music, if it's movies, nothing's gonna be an over the ear, closed style headphone, okay? And obviously, Sony is one of the best. You know, you do have Bose and a few other players in the game, but obviously that would be the first pick, okay? I'm not even gonna mention the phones because yes, you can listen to audio quality on the phones, but that's another topic. So as far as the oomph and the immersion, I'm gonna have to give it to the Samsung here, okay? It is the second generation of the earbuds, okay? The immersion is just off the chain. The volume is there, the highs are there, the bass is there, the mid-range doesn't suffer, everything comes through. I don't care if you're watching a movie or video, uh, any, I did everything from car videos to nature videos to podcasts to music, I mean, you name it. I went through a gauntlet of things. And my personal opinion, this comes first. Regardless of whether you are on an Apple or Samsung or some other platform, the immersion is just insane with that, okay? That oomph, it just really gets you into it. So if you're listening to music, you just it just hits, it punches, and that's something that Samsung is known for. Many of you know that I also review TVs. Uh, Samsung is known for having that image, that punch, that pop, same thing when it comes to video quality between you know their phones and the iPhones. So you're getting that same punch and pop when it comes to the audio quality of listening to things, okay? Now, I will give the second place to the AirPod Pro 2s. After listening to the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro 2s, it, and then I switched back into the Apple AirPod Pro 2s, the Apple AirPod Pro 2s just left me wanting more. Prior to me listening to the Apple, or should I say the Samsung Bud Okay, all these names, y'all, just run together. Prior to me listening to the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro 2s, okay, I didn't know what I was missing. As soon as I heard it on the Samsung earbuds, I was like, okay, yeah, there's a big difference. So the Apples would do it. Um, they're a, cl a, a close second. They're a good second. Everything sounds good and balanced, but after that comparison, it leaves you wanting more. But if you have not heard the Samsung Galaxy Earbud 2 Pro headphones or earbuds and all of these things that I keep calling them, you wouldn't know what you're missing. So that's what I have. And then the same thing goes with the first generation. I've always loved these. Um, the music, the punch was there. Uh, everyone knows with the Apple AirPod Pros, the first generation, they sound great. The vocal quality is there. The mix, everything is balanced, it's great. But it does lack in the bass department and some of that oomph to capture you, some of that punch, that hit that you might want to make you feel like you're experiencing the full immersion of whatever it is that you're listening to. So. In terms of noise cancellation, 
they're really about the same. I mean, once you turn the noise cancellation on, they virtually block out everything. Obviously, I'm going to have to give it a tie between these two. And that is the AirPod Pro second generation as well as the Earbud Pro second generation. To me, I mean, they're neck and neck. It's so close. I'm sure maybe if you measured it by decibels or something like that, you may actually log a difference. But in terms of what you're hearing, they both block out everything. And I think they do a great job of suppressing a pretty equal job. Uh, any loud noises, the transparency mode is essentially the same. I hadn't noticed any difference. Um, I know Apple was touting uh, hearing just like real life. I've experienced the same thing here on the Samsung Galaxy Bud Pro 2s. And they have improved on both the first generations. The first generations were good, but the second generations definitely just give you that extra oomph. So this is essentially what I have. Hopefully this helps. If you like this video, please subscribe, please comment below. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you would like to see. If there's some other type of test here with these respective AirPods and earbuds that you would like for me to do. I have much more content coming out for you. Once again, thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. And as I always say, until we stream again.